afternoon, everyone. It is a surprisingly mild Tuesday afternoon in August in New Orleans. I'm surrounded by the cemeteries in Central City, which those aren't on your tourists. not across from Commander's Palace. This is not where Dennis Hopper puked. I don't know, maybe it is. But although I'm pretty sure this is not where Nicolas Cage has his rumored pyramid. That's what I heard. I heard he has a pyramid in a cemetery waiting for him in his untimely but ultimate Departure. So here we are on lovely and amazing Washington Avenue. I used to ride down Washington Avenue every morning at like 4.30 in the morning. I'd be on my way to work for the, the Starbucks. And it was like right about here. I would see all kind of stuff at any given hour. Because sometimes it was 4.30, sometimes it was 5.30. But it was always dark and sometimes it was well lit because they'd have like fires and garbage cans or music and lights. Yeah, she needs her Tylenol PM, baby. Did you hear that? You heard me. So my, my point of my story is Washington Avenue has a, a real texture. You should come and experience it. That's all I'm saying. Make your way to the city. Forget about Bourbon Street. Washington Avenue is where it is at. It's the home of the turning point. You've never been in the turning point. Maybe you should. Maybe your experience in New Orleans is incomplete without a visit to the turning point. <clears throat> in closing, this is one of my favorite, absolute favorite houses in all of the city. And they don't pay anything in taxes. You wonder. Can you see it? Can you see it? Eh, all right. It's on Carondelet and Washington. Adios, amigos.